Well, welcome to Krug's Review. Today, we are going to review Korean snacks. Look at this. Whoa. And we're gonna be looking at those in just a minute. Hey, remember I was telling you all about the, um, how dry it's been here, drought, no rain for two months, over 100 degrees? Well, we finally got a teeny little bit of a shower a few days ago. Take a look at that. Actual rain from the skies. And our roof was so dirty and full of dirt because it hadn't rained for so long, the spout looked like it was pouring out, looked like iced tea was pouring out of the spouts. That's how dirty the roof was. But anyway, we got a little bit of relief, but not much. We're uh, set to be up near 100 or over for the next two weeks again. So we'll see. The winter's coming, so it eventually it's got to get cool. Okay, uh, before we start, I wanted to tell you that I got this. Here, I'll show you this here. I got this for my birthday, the Lego Haunted House. This is the uh, for over 18, us adults, over 3,000 pieces. So I'm going to try and get this done before the beginning of, of October so I can put it up in the house for the October time. It's for Halloween time. That'll be fun. But anyway, Haunted House, and it, it's got, uh, it lights up. Uh, it has places that it lights up. It, it has the, uh, if you know anything about, um, Disney World, the Tower of Terror ride, it actually cranks up to the bottom. I mean, sorry, it cranks up to the top and then it falls down like the ride at uh, Disney World. So that's pretty neat. It's very involved, very involved. So it's going to take me probably three or four weeks to put the thing together. So I'm really excited about that. All right, here we go. We're going to get uh, started on the uh, treats. And I think the first thing I'm going to do here, and this is sort of different, we're going to look at a drink. It says Milkus Banana. Candy can. I have no idea if this is coconut milk or if it's just some kind of... Ooh, smells real nice. Ooh, look at that. Wow. Hey, let's put this over here. Can you show me that? It's fizzy. Yeah, it's fizzy. Oh, that's wonderful. That's really, really good. It's it's not too sweet, but it's sweet enough. And here's Edison. Edison, get over here. Can you get over here with Barry? Come on over here. Edison wants to join me here. That is really good. So it's Banana Milkus by a company called Lata or something like that. Wow, I'm impressed. Really, 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 really good. Well, sweetie, you want to come over here? Let me see. Let me get him over here. Come on over here. There you go. I'm going to sit here with Barry. Jump up. Jump up. There you go. There he is. Move you over just a little bit. And I'll move over just a little bit. There we go. We're going to look at some treats. Yeah, let's start with this. Choco pie. I would imagine that this is like a moon pie, like a mini moon pie. I'm going to make a mess here. It's time to change the, um, the tablecloth to the autumn colors anyway. This is the 1st of September. So, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's like a moon pie. Mmm, good. Got a twinge of banana in that too. Oh, it is banana. Okay. <laughs> you want a little piece, sweetie? Here. Banana moon pie. All right. Now, I got two cameras, so I'm going to be looking at them. And if you're curious as to what cameras I'm using, I'm using Candy Cam here is a Canon EOS R8. The main camera is a Canon EOS R6 Mark II. And this other wider camera is a Canon EOS R7. So we have three going here. I use these at church too. They're mostly for church. I use these every week at church to record our services. Okay, let's look at, now this is fun. Look at this. Strawberry, can you see that okay? Strawberry fruit jelly. 
Ooh. It's even got, oh, can you see that? I'm afraid it's going to melt. It's got fruits inside there. And I just got it all over the tablecloth. Mmm. It's a very perfumey strawberry. Doesn't say much more on it, just strawberry fruit jelly. Very perfumey. Almost like a, <laughs> it almost tastes like a room deodorant rather than something you would eat. It doesn't really taste a lot like strawberry. You want to taste that? Yeah, see, that's good. Okay. All right, I know I'm going to make a mess here. Okay, let's look at this. <laughs> Chocolate corns. You know, I've had a lot of, I love Cheetos, and I think of cheese and corn, corn uh, niblets or whatever you want to call them, but chocolate corn? Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, that's good. It tastes like Cocoa Puffs. Look at that. That's good. Yeah. Mmm. That's good. He's so gentle when he eats that. That's good. That's good. That'll be fun to eat later. I have 20 things here, so I got to move move along pretty fast. Orion or, or Orion Orion custard soft cake. Remember, these are from Korea. All right. This looks like something you use with a strawberry shortcake. Those little pastry things. I can see that. Okay. Not great. It's okay. It's not real dry, but it's not. It's semi. Oh, I'm sorry. It's got a little bit of custard inside. You see that there? Hmm. Okay. I was going to say it's a little dry, but with the custard in the middle, that gives it another dimension. So that's sort of nice. All right, moving on. Here we go. Shrimp chips. How do you like that? I like them apples. Shrimp chips. Hmm. Smells good. Oh, they're good. And it tastes like shrimp. But it doesn't taste like gross shrimp. It tastes like good shrimp. You know, if I knew, didn't know better, I would think I'm eating fried shrimp. I kid you not. It is really, really good. I saw these earlier. See, I haven't looked at, I haven't tried any of this yet. This is all as we go here. And I thought, I'm really gonna be grossed out by this. But so far, this is my favorite thing. <laughs> That is really, really good. Wow. Shrimp chips. Okay, here's another one I thought I was going to be freaked out about. It doesn't say exactly what it is, but it just says roasted and seasoned. But if you look on the front, that looks like seaweed. So let's see what we got here. Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh. Looks like papyra. Okay. Oh, yuck. This is what I expected the chip stuff to taste like. This is really gross. It tastes like bad spinach is what it tastes like. Really slightly bitter, fishy. Not nice. I imagine people over in the Far East probably like this flavor, but my, this poor German boy does not. Okay, moving on. I have no idea what this is because it's in, uh, I guess, Korean script or Korean writing, whatever you want to call it, but um, not sure what that is. It looks like some type of corn chip. Very interesting. It almost looks like a those um, bugles, but in a different shape. See that? 
Yeah. Mmm. Okay. It's light, crunchy. Almost tastes like honey. Maybe it's honey and something else. It tastes like there's honey in it, but it's very light. It's not super sweet, but it's very pleasant. It's got this little, little boy with the thumbs up on the front. Nice. Okay. Continuing. This, again, has some Oriental writing, but there is some uh, Roman script, Ro uh, Latin uh, letters here. Golfre, Golfrete, or Golfre, I can't, I'm not sure what that says, but um, not sure what that is. Okay, this is some type of cookie. Waffle cookie. Mmm. Tastes like shortbread. Sweetie, you want a piece of that? That's good. Yeah, it's very good. It's like shortbread, but very thin like a wafer. Very buttery. Very good. Mmm. Okay, Choco Heim, Choco Hazelnut. So far, most of this stuff's been pretty good. The only thing that's been gross has been the <laughs> seaweed. Okay, this is an odd looking thing. It looks like See, by itself, it doesn't look chocolate, but I think you probably break this open. Aha. Ah, yes. And there's the chocolate inside, if you can see that. Yeah. Hmm. That's really good, too. It's a wafer. The wafer doesn't have much flavor. But the chocolate is sweet and very strong. It's like a Dutch chocolate. That's very, very good. Hmm. Boy, Korea, you're doing good. Okay, the thing is with some of these letters, I can't tell if it's upside down or not because it's hard. It's so foreign to ours. I don't know if it goes this way. I'm guessing it goes this way. Yeah, because there are uh, Latin letters on the back that go this way. So not knowing what that says, we don't know what we're going to get. Oh, they're just like crackers. These are like basic saltine crackers. Good, good with soup. It's not sweet like any of these other things are banned. It's just like a regular cracker. And that's okay. Speaking of crackers, we've got these. Rice crackers. Let's see what the difference is. I would imagine these are a lot lighter. Ah, oh, teeth time. Yeah, I'm making a mess here. Yeah, it's very, very light. Very light. I'll give you some in a second, sweetie. About what you expect. Slightly salty. Pretty plain. But it's a rice cracker. That's the way it goes. A little tough, but it's okay. There's a, a slight sweetness, too. It looks like it's sprinkled with a teeny bit of sugar and a teeny bit of salt. It's okay. Sweetie, I didn't give you a piece. Oh, I did give you a piece of this, didn't I? I did give you a piece of that, didn't I? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh, we're getting down near the bottom. This says Crown Sando, S-A-N-D-O, strawberry. The writing, I'm thinking it's upside down, but it's not. Let's give this a try. 
Okay, this is a cream cookie. A cookie with, let's open it up and see what it looks like inside. Okay, it just looks like a regular... It says strawberry on it, so it should be strawberry. Mmm. Very good. I smelled, smelled the strawberry before I even got it in my mouth. That's really good. Mmm. Really good. Wow. Okay. Nice. Homemade type cookie. Crown. So you get this here so you can see it all. This looks like uh, sort of like one of those um, shortbread cookies again. Just to remind you, this is all from Korea. This is okay. It's not as buttery as that other one. In fact, if I didn't know better, I'd say there's a hint of peanut butter in this. Almost tastes like a little bit of peanut butter, and it's not as sweet. A little more plain. It's okay, but that other one was so close to a shortbread that these thin ones, they were really good. Okay, continuing. This writing is really different. I have no idea. It looks like it's got little, little fat cats on it. I'm not sure what that's all about. CW is all it says. Oh, look at that. Oh. It's a chocolate, chocolate chip cookie. Mmm. And it's soft. Oh, and it's got chewy chocolate in it. Oh, this is marvelous. This is wonderful. Mmm. Mm, give you a piece. Tess Edison, you want a piece of this cookie? There you go. There you go. Wow. That's really good. In fact, it's got chocolate chips, but the chewy part is not chocolate. It's like a fig or something like that. Some type of um, filling. Mm. Very, very good. Okay, I have two of these. I have no idea how to pronounce that. I'm not going to try to. One says white and one says coffee. Here's the white. And this is the coffee. Let's try the white first. It's probably just a plain vanilla. It looks like a... Oh, that's interesting. It's pretty neat. Very nice. Again, it's got that shortbread tendency, but it's not a super sweet. But it's not not sweet. It's right in the middle. Very good. Let's try the coffee one. Looks the same as the other one. Hmm. There's a very, very minute difference. I can taste it. There's coffee there. It's very, very weak. Okay, we got two more. This one says, again, we got another rice, rice crackers. Don't you want that, sweetie? You want one of those? Very light again. Very, very light. Mmm. I like this one better. It's got a little more salt and a little more flavor. A little more substantial. Yeah, that's good. All right. I believe this is our last one. Yep. And again, I believe it's a CW, whatever that is. Maybe it's that Crown Company. I'm not sure. But um, I know it goes this way because there's a CW at the top. <laughs> there you go. You see that? I have that uh, candy cam on a fixed focus because the last time I would hold up 
the candy and the camera was on autofocus, but it was on autofocus for my eyes. So unless I covered my eyes with the candy, it focused on my eyes. So I was sort of frustrated with that. So I have it on a fixed focus. So I'm hoping when I hold it at this arm's length, that's about correct. Uh, I can tell if it's in focus, I have a red, there's a red outline on the deal there, but it's sort of hard to see on that little screen over there. All right. All right. Not sure what this is, but it said CW and it's gooey. Ooh, it's real gooey. Mmm. Not super sweet. But it's got a jelly inside. You see that? It's good. It's got a vanilla flavor. I'm not sure what flavor the jelly is inside. I'm not getting a lot from that, but it's good. It's a nice treat. It's pretty good. Mmm. Well, that, this was our journey today. We went through a lot of stuff. And I will have to say, almost I, I liked almost everything here. I think the only thing I wasn't crazy about was the first rice crackers or rice cookies we looked at. They were ho-hum. And then this horrible seaweed stuff. Everything else was wonderful. There were some really, really nice things here. Well done, Korea. Well, stay with us. Like and subscribe. In about a month, we are going to be doing candy and treats from India, and that will be really special. India will be next, and hopefully I can show you my, uh, my haunted house here. It'll be done by then. Thanks again. Thanks for being with us today, and we will see you, as always, on the flip side.